quick little mail day today. Um, package from Barbaric Brutality, package from FYL Records, and a thing from Hail Shatar that I got a couple days ago. So I'll start with that actually. So this is the new Fluids and Oxidized Razor split. It is The fluid side's called Smile and the World Smiles With You. Mm, there you go. I can't really tell where that is. All right. There's the cover. It might be a little blurry. I'm not sure. There you go. And in the back, the Oxidized Razor side is called Deceased, which is track one on the album. So if you don't know, Fluids are Mortician Worship, Brutal Death Metal, also Gore Grind, also just death metal stuff. Um, and Oxidized Razor are just straight gore grind from Mexico. Fluids are from Arizona. So here's the tape. It's on white shell. Um, the way the packaging is, it's pretty cool. It's got this white, it's got the blank white uh, casing and then the uh, single, the cassette single type uh, cover thing. So, yeah. There is the Fluids pamphlet. There are three songs, I think. Bound, gagged, and injected. So, yep, pretty good stuff. And then there's the oxidized razor side. Uh, the songs are there are Deceased, Cannibalism, and Viscera Corrodosis. Not sure. Um, so, yeah, this is uh, this was released on Gruen Gore's record label, but I got mine from Hail Shatar because he offered me a copy because he only got one through a trade. So, I took that immediately. Didn't even get a chance. Er, like, as soon as he sent me the message, I opened that up, and I took it right away, so, yes. Very good stuff. I'll show you a song from both of these, because I know I can get both of the songs. Um, this actually, the Fluids has a new vocalist. It's not Cole anymore. It's uh, uh, Brennan from Thorn, and Xeno Ooze, Glitter Bomb, a bunch of other projects. So, it's pretty cool. Uh, I like his voice a lot. It's, it's, it's not like old uh, Fluids, but it definitely works, so... Pretty good stuff, so I'll show you songs for that and we'll get on the next stuff. <laughs> thing it's just a small little one inch pen from Gordozer they are a newer well it's one man but it's a newer um, uh, gore grind band from California I want to say it has the dude from one of the guys from uh, Haggis I think his name's Tim I'm not sure but I ordered this from his record label thing so it's pretty cool it was only a dollar so I just ordered one so that's all that is uh, they just had just put out some new shirts but um, yeah, so they got new shirts, and I think the new, there's an album, I don't know how new it is, but I hadn't heard of it before, and then I listened to it, and I really liked it, so I bought the pin, because why not? It was cheap enough to throw on my Gorgon jacket, so definitely check that out. Um, it's not like Haggis, I don't think, it was more its own thing, so pretty good stuff. So I'll play you a song for that. So finally, we got um, the long-awaited pre-order from Barbaric Brutality, and there it is. It's in this like biohazard bag, and it came with a little gift with it. So I'll show you what's inside. So this was the Slams Giving pre-order. So back in thanks back by Thanksgiving, what happened was he tried to get a new guy to do the tapes just because he wanted to support uh, DIY and all that, and the tapes didn't turn out the way he wanted. So he had to redo it with his like the normal dude that he has. So it took a little longer than expected, but they do look really good. So um, I'll start with Septic Congestion, which is uh, the dude Jack from Cranium. It's his other band, and also they're on the colored uh, shell or uh, casings. So there we go. This album is called Souls to Consume. It's just some awesome slam from Norway, I want to say. I think that's where they're from. So there it is. This like lime green see-through stuff. Then there's that. Um, let's see. These turned out really nice. I think these are some of the nicest tapes I have now. There's the inside. I just like the whole green look and all that. Except the congestion, X, uh, Barbaric Brutality, Hammers. So yeah, it's got uh, Jack and I don't know the other people, I don't think. Mm. Yeah, their names don't ring a bell to me, but anyways, really good album. Um, let's see, 
Anything else with this? Um, there's a lot of tracks, 10 tracks. Uh, I won't read them all off, but so there's 10 tracks on here, so definitely worth a good listen. There's the back, nice and green, and I will show you the next one. one is Monumental Discharge. The album is called Unfathomable Defecation and it is on orange cassette uh, casing. It's really tight. I have to listen to that real quick. So you got the see-through bright orange and then the same as the back. It looks like the subject congestion one only it's a little different. And then same thing in here. Kind of same layout not really because this one doesn't have pictures but the cover looks really cool and all that. So there's that. I like their logo. They follow me. Well, both these bands, Subject Congestion and uh, My Method Discharge, both follow me on Instagram, so that's cool. Um, so, yes, let's see. This is a newer release. I believe it was 2019 or yeah, 2020. There's seven tracks on this one, so real good stuff. Both of these are great. I like the color scheme and all that, how they did, how, how uh, Michael pulled that off. And then, real quick, they gave a two Barbaric Brutality green stickers. So there's that. I will show you songs for both for the uh, Monumental Discharge now, and there's one more item in the bag. All right, so the final item was a free gift. Um, I remember a couple, like a week ago or whatever, they said that they were gonna have a free item with it, and I don't remember, I didn't, I didn't pay attention to it because it was right when my Instagram account got banned, so I didn't really look into it because, yeah. So, it is a newer band, Catatonic, uh, Catatonic, I think, maybe? I don't remember. Cataton yeah, Catatonic Stupor, maybe, so. There you go, it has the one dude, I think he did guest vocals with Snuffed On Sight on, uh, down the 2020 or whatever. So there's that. And then the inside says no brain, no pain. And then there's a bunch of dead faces. So that's pretty cool. I'm not sure what genre this is at all. I haven't got a chance to listen to it. I, I saw the release of it and all that. But, so I have not got a chance yet, but I will try to find a song. I'm pretty sure it's on YouTube. So there's a the disc. Very cool that he included this for free since like we had to wait and all that. So it's actually really nice of him. Which I didn't care about the wait because I'm patient, but it's very nice of him to add that, so I will appreciate that. Nice little thing to add to my CDR bin, even though I don't think it's a CDR, I think it's, it might be, let me see, uh, it might be, I'm not sure, but I can't really, I don't think I put that on my shelf because it doesn't have the spine, so add that to the bin, there we go. So yeah, that is everything, uh, I will play a song real quick and then I'll show you what I got playing in the background. So right now I have Terrors or World Downfall, uh, one of the first grindcore albums playing. Um, 16 tracks, a uh, really classic album. Um, one of the best, one of the best grindcore albums in my opinion. It was released on Earache and yeah, early, early stuff. I wanna say, I don't remember what year, let me see. Does it say anywhere? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't remember what year, but it's it's really it's an older album, so yeah, pretty good stuff. So, anyways, thank you all for watching, and yeah, I'll see you next video I do. It'll probably be another mail day because that's all I can think of doing. So yeah.